Hi, I'm Pierre, based in Berlin, and I lead the data and AI portfolio for public sector globally at Capgemini. I think public services have a great momentum and a threefold story right now um, in regards to collaborative data ecosystem. First, they have a policy making aspect. They are currently really setting up the play field where basically collaborative data ecosystem will occur. Second, they have a purpose-driven task and they look at uh, topics such as sustainability or healthcare. And third, they um, have a non-competitive spirit. Uh, these are all agencies not competing with each other, but actually facing similar challenges and therefore also enabling to uh, profit from data sharing. And uh, what I like about these three aspects of the story is basically uh, that public sector is looking beyond its own perimeter and at the end of the day is both a player and referee of a game that benefits a uh, whole society. On the one hand, uh, I think that what really uh, enabled a push is that the public sector provided itself with a framework to trust data sharing. Um, rulings, regulations, directives such as the Data Act of the European Union or the GDPR uh, in the past years have really provided rules and uh, principles to play on data sharing. The second part of my answer would be about the democratization of the AI artificial intelligence momentum. By discovering AI, public organizations have pushed themselves to understand the value of data they sit on or not, and therefore also to use it and leverage it as a source of insights. I think a collaborative data ecosystem starts with collaboration. So basically the um, principles of different stakeholders coming together. It continues with the foundation to this collaboration, which is the ecosystem. And here um, it uh, necessitates basically clear governances clear principles of data sharing and a clear understanding of what is the goal and what's not. Um, and to end basically um, is on the insights as a result of this collaboration within an ecosystem. And there the driver and the benefit can be very different from uh, one context to another. It can be about uh, cost efficiency, it can be about uh, new insights that one organization couldn't have before or it can be about a citizen engagement. And that is exactly my point here. In the complex world we live in, this is uh, the level of insights we need for uh, job centers to collaborate with uh, national employment agencies and skills platforms, but also for a city or a smart territory to collaborate on data with um, the local startups or the population um, and industry. To enable that journey, I think there are two phases uh, needed. Public organizations will need to go through a uh, vision and strategy phase where they will define basically um, the goal and also questions like the data ownership or the stakeholders involved. In the second phase, it will be all about embracing the emerging trends and technologies needed like differential privacy, homomorphic encryption or federated learning that will bring the platform and the data platform foundations to their resiliency level that is needed to embrace collaborative data ecosystem. At Capgemini, we are blessed with many exciting stories such as the EU Center for Data Sharing. I'd like to emphasize especially one story that comes from Spain, where a collaboration between free hospitals and telco companies has accelerated the fight versus COVID by applying artificial intelligence and new federated learning techniques. These hospitals were able to increase the efficiency in symptom assessment and therefore tackle this real time problem by sharing data with the relevant actors. First, organizations shall identify the purpose and the case behind the data sharing. 
Second, organizations should look into the right level of privacy and trust needed in order to make the data sharing fly. Third and last, organizations should get creative about how and who they involve in the data sharing ecosystem. This can actually mean to involve the citizen, who is not only a consumer of data anymore, but is uh, actually rising to the level of a sovereign producer of data. These are insights crucially needed in order to tackle societal challenges such as environmental sustainability or digital inclusion.